So which fraction here is greater? 3 eighths or 1 half? Well, there's a few ways you could tell. First, you could divide 3 by 8, get a decimal. 1 by 2, get a decimal. Just compare them. That would tell you if 3 eighths is greater than or less than 1 half. The other way is we could find a common denominator. So if we had the same denominators, we just compare the numerators and we're done. So why don't we take 2 times 4? Because if I multiply 2 times 4, that gives me 8. Up here, I already have 8 in the denominator. I'm just going to keep that the same like that. But since I multiplied the denominator by 4 here, I've got to multiply the numerator by 4 as well. That's because 4 over 4, that just equals 1. So we don't change the value, just the way it's written. 1 times 4, that is 4. 4 eighths, that's the same thing as 1 half. They both equal 0 0.5. But now, because we have the same denominator, compare the numerators. 4 is bigger than 3. So 4 eighths, that's bigger than 3 eighths by 1 eighth. So because these are equivalent, 1 half, that's larger than 3 eighths as well. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.